All right, hello everybody. This is Jubilant Jeff's channel. Welcome back to my channel. In case you are coming across to my channel for the first time, please click on the subscription button below and also click on the notification button so you can always get notification each time I do my video, okay? So this morning I want to show us how you can interpret an image with, with Chinese content on it, with Chinese words on it, okay? In case probably you are trying to log into a Lipe account or you want to log into 1688 account and an error message pops up and you don't understand what that error message means because it's in Chinese, how you can actually go about it to understand what best to do, okay? So assuming, let's assume you are working with your Alipay account or you are doing something on 1688 or any Chinese platform, uh, an error message pops up on your screen written in Chinese and you don't know what it means, you don't know the next action to take from there because you don't understand the written words. What you do at that point, you screenshot that message, okay? Once you screenshot that message, you come to your Google Translate. Of course, you should have your Google Translate by now. So this is my Google Translate. You click it open. Once it open, you change it by click on this. You can see the arrow, the two arrow here. You click, it changes to Chinese to English. You click here, can you see it? So once you leave it at Chinese to English, because you want to translate to Ch uh, from Chinese to English now, all right? But once you want to translate from English, you click again, it changes this way. But right now we want to translate from Chinese to English. So if you look down here, you can see camera. So what you do at that point, you click on the camera icon, camera icon, it brings you to this point, okay? So don't mind me. So it brings you to this point. You click on the image gallery icon below here. All right, it takes you to the recent. So where you now click on the screenshotted image. So just watch, this is an image I screenshotted from a Chinese um, on Alipay, okay? So once it marks like this, all you just need, use your finger and highlight it, okay? Highlight it, you can see the trans insufficient memory card space. All right, you can see that's the reason, okay? It's telling you that you have insufficient memory card space. So which means you need to clean up your memory space, okay? You need to clean up your memory, delete some things and so that you, know, you have space in your phone. So if you want to read all that content here, you highlight everything here, okay? You highlight everything here. Now, it gives you the remaining space for your mobile. You keep, you press the arrow. The arrow will show you everything. But if you press this arrow, it will take you out of this page now because you still have other things there. You have to redo it again to translate. But this one, what I do, you use your finger, you drag it this way to read through. It said the remaining, okay, I've clicked on the arrow page. So the remaining space of your mobile phone memory card is insufficient, which may affect Alipay's normal sending and receiving of messages. Please delete the applications or files that are not commonly used on your mobile phone in time or you can immediately clear the storage space of Alipay. Okay, this is the message they are telling you. Now, if you go back, you go back again, you know you have two buttons, you need to um, select, either you go forward or yeah, you can see the two buttons below here. So you know what next to do, you check this one, what is this one saying? Okay, ignore, that means you want to ignore the error, or you click here, uh, what is this? Space cleaning. So if you click this place, it will not take you further to where you need to clean your space and do uh, clean your space and create space for this. So that is how you can translate an image. Okay. For those of you that you while working on Alipay or Cisnet an error message pops up. You don't know how to translate it. This is just simple way to translate a text in in Chinese that is an image format. I believe you've got value from this. And I believe you learned something from it, okay? So you can always translate Chinese uh, to English anytime you encounter such um, error again on, while working on Cisnetit and Alipay. Thank you very much for listening. And um, please do well to subscribe and also like and share. And also click on the notification button. I love you all. See you next time.